gotta la la I got a guy who loves me so dear He calls me special in the apple of his eyes Now maybe it's the way that my God walks in a cruel love day Maybe it's the way that my God talks Jesus is the way Or maybe it's the him in all in all The him in every we're here to lift up the name of Jesus and praise our daddy God, huh? How many know that he's our daddy? We all know that, huh? He's our daddy God. And, and he, he just wants a relationship with him. And, and I'm telling you, it's just so awesome. The vision doesn't call him daddy, though. You know what we call him? We call him dad dad. dad. <laughs> so it's kind of like, like the way we call him is just dad dad, daddy, or however you want to call him. But he is our daddy God, amen? And how awesome that is. I just know uh, that we're going to lift up the name of Jesus. And I pray that you have a wonderful time. Okay? Amen. Sweet Holy Spirit. messages of them all for Christian people like you and I to receive. But if you dare to believe it, receive it, act on it, and meditate it, it will radically alter your life and take you from religion to a reality. What is this reality that God wants us to know and to stand on? Is this. Tell my children, my precious children, which mean, which mean that it's you and me, that they are everything to me that Jesus is. Amen? Do we call on Jesus' name? Amen. Yeah, even the heathens call on Jesus on. Oh, like when they're at a scary movie, well, what's the first thing when a scary part comes on? What do they say? Jesus. Oh. But we call on Jesus anytime we want to. Amen. Praise God. Calling on Jesus.
speed up the process in this testimony, but uh, beer and alcohol was my downfall. And uh, the thing is, is that at first it was good. I was able to hold a job and I was able to go ahead and take care of business, you know. I've never been married, ain't married to this day, but I, I've i always had uh, a relationship with, 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 a, with a, a girl that we had kids together and everything. But anyways, alcohol was my downfall, and uh, no matter what, it, it was good all the way through my, I mean, it was trying to be good all the way through my life, and it was sprinkly, and it was sparkly, and it was just a life in the pit of hell. Come on, who's with me on that? Because I ended up in the hospital at the age of 43, 43 years old, and the doctor said that I was not gonna leave that hospital to call my family. And sure enough, when I was laid up in that hospital bed and, and the doctor came in and told me that, I did call my family. And my family uh, were planning a car wash to bury me because they couldn't afford the, the funeral expenses. But for some reason, uh, some members of Fountains of Living Water Church out of, out of Casagrande, Arizona, got hold of the news and they sent uh, soldiers to go pray with me and, and show me some scriptures in the word. And they showed me uh, 1 Peter 2, 24, by his stripes I am healed. They said, if I stand on that scripture, that I will be healed. Because really, uh, they explained it like this. They go, you got healed 2,000 years ago. So if you consider it done, then it shall come to pass. In other words, it has come to pass. So I stood on it and I said, think I ain't going to let that go? Oh, my goodness. So I started meditating on it and I kept it. And sure enough, the next day, I got up like a free man. Yeah. The doctor came in, said, how you feeling, Steve? I said, I feel good. I want some ice cream. I wanted some ice cream. Now, we got to understand that they diagnosed me with some uh, sugar diabetes, high blood pressure. Couldn't have none of that stuff. But when they gave me another test, a blood test, he came in and said, you can have all the ice cream you want. I was totally healed, totally delivered. This was six years ago. And all I take is vitamins to this day. So we got to understand we have a miracle working God. And we know 
that he is awesome and he is madly in love with us. All these songs that you're going to hear right now is all originals. All original songs from, from, from the vision, okay? They're just songs that we've written and we took a we took, uh, process to, to write them down through the Holy Spirit. So I pray that you enjoy the words, okay? In the name of Jesus. I got a guy. Yeah. Testing one, two, three. One, two, three. Here we go now. Uh, and have fun with it, okay? Uh, Here we go now. Slower beat, okay? Let's do it. Now, 
let me ask my drummer over here Come something. On, man, it's been a long time I've been wanting to ask you this question. Ask him. Come on. Who is that man Jesus. that said oh. all these captives free? Jesus, the son of the most high. All oh, glory. Yeah. One, two, three, four.
I think you might. I, I think I think you know the answer. Because I made Jesus my Lord and Savior. Oh, hallelujah. It got better now. Amen. Thank you, Father God. Ain't it fun being a Christian? Come on. sitting in here in love with Jesus Christ in unity. Oh, he hates it. He is a devil of division. But when we sit right here and we know that we love each other because Jesus lives in us, we have one thing in common and that's Jesus. And he wants us to live in unity. Our daddy God is looking down upon us smiling because we're doing it. Amen? Here we go now. Ready?
Oh, oh, oh. 